Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2016 Ford Edge SEL. Now the most notable features on this SEL is its backup camera. You also have your push button start and your heated front seats. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2016 Ford Edge SEL. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this SEL is its daytime running lights and then if we take a closer look at your front hood you'll see your hood deflector over on the side you have your 18 inch wheels. Now the nice thing is you do have your foldable mirrors as well as your integrated signal lamps and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is blue. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you do have your black leather interior seat surfaces with your power driver seat and lumbar support. Taking a look on your left hand side, you have your light controls and then on the inside of your driver's side door you have your power locks, mirror controls as well as your window locks and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function. You'll also have your cruise control setting, scroll function, as well as your seek function with your Bluetooth connectivity, your voice recognition, and your volume control. Now, you do have the paddle shifters on here as well. And the other nice thing is you do have the push button start. So, all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now, taking a look at the multi informational display, you'll see a couple of different options on here. So taking a look, as you can see, you have your average fuel economy, distance to empty, but you can also go through your trip info on here as well. And scrolling down a little bit farther, you'll find your driver assist as well as your settings menu, just so you can personalize everything for yourself. Now, taking a look at your center dash as well as your display, you'll see a couple of different options on here. Now, if we actually take a look at the top here, you do have some storage space. And going inside your menu controls, you'll see your radio menu as well as a couple of other additional settings in here as well. Now to actually scroll through this menu, you'll be using the controls that are just located on the right hand side of the steering wheel here. And if we take a look down a little bit further, you have your volume and tune, as well as your hazard lights, temperature control settings, and then you'll also find your heated seat controls for your driver and passenger. If we take a look on the inside here, you have some uh, storage space here as well as your USB and auxiliary input mounted to an automatic transmission. And I'm just going to throw this into reverse just so I can show you what the backup camera looks like. So as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you try to back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate now located on the back of your tailgate underneath your Ford emblem. You'll see your backup camera and your rear hatch release located just down below. Now I'm just going to close in on the rear cargo area just so you have a much better idea of how much room there is. Now if you do need some more additional space, you can fold down that 60-40 split rear seat. And if we take a look just underneath the floor, you'll find your spare tire as well as your jack and toolkit. So if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch, you know exactly where it's located. You also have a couple of areas that you can um, store some smaller items just in case you do need some additional space. And taking a look just over on the side here, as you can see, you have that power outlet. But the other nice thing is that you can actually fold down these seats from back here. So just by pushing on the button, you can fold down the seats right away, just making uh, that much, well, making it that much more easier to get that extra cargo space right away if you need it. Thank you so much, folks, for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this 2016 Ford Edge SEL, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455, or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.